Hello everyone, and welcome back to Two Bros Game Night. I am your host, Older Bro. I'm your other host, Younger Bro. And today we continue in Sonic Unleashed, where Sonic is very much not unleashed, and we are about to start the stage, Savannah Citadel Act 1. Yay! Play stage. It's a nighttime stage, which means great, more fucking combat. Let's watch Older Bro fan. Hey, this isn't a rhythm section. You doubt its power. You underestimate my power! Oh yeah, by the way, you can use these triggers to run, and he does this. Yeah, he gets on all fours. He's yeah. faster, see? You do go faster in these seconds. Well, then tell Sonic to do that all the time. Well, you would. It's just that night you can't help it because he transforms with makes him slower. Please die. Imagine if this made him an actual monster and he was a, su a supersonic monster. So, he got all the Chaos Emeralds. No. Then what do you want about? Like, when he transformed, he became mindless. Are they giving me the tutorial for block pushing? After I did the block pushing puzzle. Where am I even pushing this to? What the fuck was that? Oh. I still don't know what that was, actually. It's stuff. This grass is so tall. Yeah, where the, what the hell is the point of this? It looks like it's just a block t pushing tutorial. But... There didn't seem to... Oh, there it is. They wanted me to pull it off the grass. Get your ass off the grass, boy. We need to rub our shells with the grass. I don't know what the fuck. You're not a cat, Sonic. Come on, he loves the grass. This he wants isn't to roll cat now. In it. It's just normal grass that grows on every human being's lawn and in the wild as well. And also there's a metal back here. Of course there is. Are you serious? Apparently finding this metal is a trigger for enemies. Which are a bit hard to see given that they're in a fucking corner. Also, one annoyance about this game is that the enemies do not immediately die when you kill them. You have to, you have to stop hitting them. This is a very bad design decision for many reasons. One of which being that in most cases you do not know when you've killed an enemy. And there's another one. You, 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 you become the enemy. So, it just encourages you to continuously keep hitting the enemy forever. I mean, you can. You can get. Like, you know that you've stopped having a combo, but that's it. But yeah, you can infinitely just hit the enemy. Yeah, I don't like when that happens. I like when the enemy just falls down dead and you can't collision them anymore because they died. Um. In. Spider Man Friend or Foe, it does the same thing where you can infinitely combo the enemy. Yeah. And you actually get combo off it? It doesn't just stop the combo gauge? No, I, I've got it up to max before. and I, insanity. And I, I wanted to see how long it would take for me to fail. I want to say it took me an hour and a half. That's insanity. Yeah, an hour and a it half just beating on one enemy. <laughs> it is insanity that a game would allow such a thing, and insanity that you would do it. Well, yeah, it was a long time ago before I'm like, nah, I just want to beat the game. Yeah. Because back when he wasn't even a completionist, he was just a weirdo. It was back when I first started to play games. I just about grabbed him there. I don't know what grabbing the enemy does. Oh, you got Discord... Uh, message and Sonic. Uh, I hope not. That'd be weird. Oh, right. This is the, uh... That just suplex you? Yeah, it's the part where you can do button uh, mashing. Oh. Are you spinning him like a top? I did actually hit squares. I'm not sure what the problem with that was. 
Yeah, I don't like button mashing inputs, so I'm just going to hit them. He's got the problem with you. Yeah, I, I don't like that. I don't... I barely can do those on a Nintendo console where I know exactly where the button controls are. I can't do that on a PlayStation where it has weird buttons like cross. Um, okay, I'm gonna need a box for that. A spinning lever. Yeah, spinning. Uh -huh. Grab it. Grab, grab, grab the thing. Thank you. Um, yeah, in the PS3 version, I don't even remember levers like that. Yeah, in the in the PS2 version, um, you just grabbed a lever and moved it. Yep. Yeah, you didn't rotate like you just did. Yep. Makes sense. Again, they were better versions of the game. And we wanted to torture ourselves. No, younger bro wanted to torture me. You're right. <laughs> Again. You have no input in this. You only are playing in the parts where I literally cannot do the thing because it's a rhythm section. Um, otherwise, it's you're just torturing me. Okay, uh, I'm expecting I need to go up higher. Can I get up somewhere over here that I'm not understanding? Can I climb on this, for example? Um, Doesn't look like it. I think... That thing can go higher. But I can't get up here if that goes higher. The only- Oh, there's a block there. Oh, you yeah, you need to lower it and put the block on there. That would make sense now, wouldn't it? Yeah, the puzzles were not this complicated in the- You didn't even move blocks in the PS2 version. Yeah. Like, I got pretty far in the game and I don't remember moving a block. It was typical son Sonic levels where you go through the level as quick as you can, and that's it. I mean, that's technically what you're doing here. Yeah, but you were timed. That's technically Even what in the Werehog sections. I mean, you're technically timed here, just not no, on No, screen. there is no timer. It's not on screen. Yeah, you're going to see, that's how you solve a puzzle. No, I think we were both wrong. See, I can't get up there. That block is not for putting on the thing. That's to allow me to get up. Slower a little bit. There you go. Yeah, but now it's not as tall. Yeah, that block is supposed to help you get up there. No. No, it isn't. You have to jump on top of the block. You're misunderstanding here. Just, just watch. Just take the block off. And now raise it. Sonic, please. Thank you. And now I get on the block. And then I get up here. And now I can get up here. It didn't get done either way. No, it's... This wasn't able to get as high, even with the block. It was actually lower than this right now, with the block on it. Really? Really. Okay. Fuck the <laughs> game. <laughs> Look at Sonic's feet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, if I just run into it really fast, it'll move, right? Let this move! Get you to groove. Like obviously, it's just you know speed that's the problem here. It's gold. I guess I technically have already hit the, the button. Okay. Gold and silver. Silver and gold. Silver and gold means so much more when I I knew it. Not go over there. We don't want the secret. I think the jumping is cooler in this game. Please tell me you show us the door. I think it was just another way to open the door. Oh. Okay! Didn't mean to jump down there, but that works too. 
jump down and then and then and Well, you gotta kill more enemies. Hey, we got the goalpost. Goal! Did you, did you kick a field goal into it? Uh, no, wrong kind of soccer. Or football, whatever. Football. Wrong kind of soccer. Wrong kind of football. Actually, yeah, uh, no, soccer is the right kind of football, and rugby is American football. Oh, right, I have to tap. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. Remember, guys, uh, yeah. the sport you love is American rugby, not football. And Europeans, the sport you love is soccer, not football. I like how we call Are we clear? I like how we call it football in yes. America, and we hold it half the time. But I guess we didn't want to call it handball, so we're like, yeah, let's just steal it from soccer called football. No, it's uh, it's a lot more complicated than that. Because, um, so here's the thing. People love to make this joke all the time. They love to make the joke of, oh, why is it called football? You use your hands. That's not what football means. Football doesn't mean you use your foot. It means the sport is on foot. It was a term used to differentiate against Horseback sports. Okay. So it's golf is football because it is a sport you do on your feet rather than on a mount. Ah, uh, I see. So football is so American football is football. So is soccer. That type of it's football. a category of sports. We so just need yes. Names. Oh, I had infinite unleashed, and I could have just done that. Well, that was wasteful. Um, so yeah, it is absolutely correct. Let's switch on the wall. Uh, it is absolutely correct to call football American football football, and it is absolutely correct to call soccer football because they're both on foot. I thought you were going to say they're both on drugs, but okay. Well, probably, but I I'm not going to speak <laughs> to the uh, players. To uh, the players of the game. Yeah. We, we, back in my day, yeah, we so used like, steroids, not this meth. We used steroids! Not this crystal meth the youngins are taking nowadays. That's still steroids. What the? Yeah, that's what I thought. Isn't there a ground um, pound move? Yeah. Anybody remember what it is? No. Oh, good. Oh, there's a metal down here. Perfect. I need to get that. Yeah, I think it's wanting me to ground pound this, but I can't remember. Oh, uh, I think you can check the controls. Uh, any memory of where that is? Um. Is it not on the pause menu? I don't think so. Uh, hold on. Before I before I do that, let me, yeah, level up my ring energy. Okay. Uh, what did I want to do here? Um, combat up. Oh, we don't. Oh, I'm an idiot. It shares levels between characters. Yeah. EXP is the same. I thought it was the EXP you got in the, the Sonic levels only was for the Sonic levels. Nope, you can... You idiot. Oh, I think you have to throw the enemy at the switch. That makes a lot of sense. That's okay. why I keep spawning one in. That makes a lot of sense. Okay, uh, I think I have to go kill that one because I don't think it's going to respawn until then. Where'd it go? Underneath. I'm guessing we grab it with a grab. Yep. Toss that some bitch. Square. Oh, okay. That was not clear. You got it. We got this. We got this together. Uh, cutscene. See, it takes two bro geniuses to figure it out. Okay, uh, I wouldn't call myself a genius, and I especially wouldn't call you a genius. 
I am a grade A genius in gaming. No. Nothing you just said is true. Oh, this on, is hold. not like anything you just said. Yeah. All you have just said is yes, yeah, see I knew you could do a ground pound. So it's it's O O X to do a ground pound. Or square square X, sorry. You just show you can him. Sure. Show you can. Bam! Blam. It's not wanting to do it now. Do it, dear. Do it. There it goes. But yeah, I think there's also better combat in the. In the previous two games. Yeah, the combat in this feels a lot more complicated. Unnecessarily. To be fair. Yeah, and then PS2 version is a lot more simple. Yeah. That almost felt like an action, like, movie thing. Where, like, you, uh, slow down time and stay in the air for, like, way too long. You're still not dead. My god. Needy. So it could actually bend the laws of time and pause it in midair, just like Fiona did in the first Shrek okay, movie. Okay, so let's see what this does. So this moves that up. It's a bridge. It also controls the bridge. No, the bridge is moving on its own. No, it is? Okay. Yeah. Okay, so same thing here, I think. Yeah, we just moved the box and grabbed the ledge. Come on. Get on the box. Thank you. Now get on the thing. I hate when game designers, like, make ledges just barely enough to get up. Because sometimes you can get stuck on yes. those ledges and not actually make it. Yep. I had this problem in LEGO Jurassic World. Yeah, it, it sucks. Okay, let's get up here. hate precision platforming in 3D games, guys. It's really bad. We should have more- oh, isn't that metal? Go back. Right there. Over there. Oh, I can't get in over there. I assume it doesn't have to go around. Oh, it's a book. Oh, and a metal. I don't know what the hell that book is. I think Actually, it's... I think one of those is a record. Yeah. I think there was just like three different things in here. I think it's. I think the books are like extras, like galleries. Inventory. Apparently, there's nothing in our inventory. Why do we even have an inventory? I assumed it was gonna be from the book. No, it's just a collectible, but it's not a physical item. It's like you. Again, Let's it's like you unlock physical. something in a gallery. Yeah. Physical. Okay, I'm just gonna put all my experience into that right now. We'll approach combat. Uh, that's where we came from, right? Yes. Okay. You want to go back to where you jumped from? I know. That's what I'm trying to do. Okay. Now let's go this way. But yeah, I, I'm gonna be very unfair to combat for a second. I think com I don't think that platformer games. Or sorry, not combat. Platforming. I don't think platformer games should have ever left 2D. I think that platforming in 3D is almost universally terrible, and that it they should have just stayed in the in 2D. Well, what about Metroid? Metroid isn't 2 it isn't 3D most of the time, and also is not really a platformer. But it was made to look 2D. Like, 99% of the Metroid games, like, outside of Prime and Other M, every Metroid game has been 2D. Including Dread. Yeah, Dread is still 2D. Also, guys, I've been playing Dread off camera a little bit, and the, uh, I told Younger Brother this, the shine sparking in Dread is, um, very unique. And I don't mean that necessarily in a bad way, it's just that they, they... They went above and beyond to try to make the, um, to try to make the 
uh, plat or the shine spark in that very, very strange. Very difficult. I Not even very difficult. Up. What? You don't spin in this game? That's what I thought he said, but he doesn't seem to. Grab a flying monster and you can get to the other side. Sure, I'll try. I don't even know if you can kill these things. Nope, they're platforms. Yeah, I've never successfully done it. Keep checking it. Got it. And up it goes. Oh. Well, I got it. You got... Oh, that one's a life. Oh, I think I got a life. That's what the other one was in there. Uh, was I supposed to go here? I think so, yeah. Okay, because that wasn't clear. Like, I couldn't tell if I was doing the wrong thing or the right thing there, so. And do the next right thing. There's a thing down there. There's another life. I got another life, wow. Okay, game. Need to calm the fuck down. Go I know straight. you're having a hard time with this game, so we're going to give you more lives. I mean, that is how a lot of games do it, actually. Yeah, that was also a life. Yeah, we, we made this area totally shit. And we don't care, but we'll give you lives to compensate. Yeah. We don't care. Sometimes I kind of don't care. I just wanted to make sure there wasn't anything down there. I was thinking it was gonna be. But yeah, I, you fling yourself in this game, but I guess you just don't spin when you grab those anymore. No, it was too resource heavy for this game. Okay, please stop. I guess. Maybe they figured Ugh. out, hey, the spinning is unnecessary, so we'll just have them jump. Yeah, basically. The fucking moving forward is terrible in this game. It's so terrible. So what you're telling me is we gotta keep moving forward? Basically. Keep moving forward. What the? Keep moving, keep moving, I see, You know, I moving. see why this section is uh, here. Yeah, I'm just gonna go on the side. Fuck that movement. It's faster this way anyways. There's a buzzsaw, I just noticed. It's gonna cut you into ribbons. Oh, that sucks. It's an in and out movement. Um, yeah, they didn't have this in the PS2 game. Yeah, I can't imagine. What the fuck? What the hell? It You're wouldn't getting let me stuck go on the collision. Yeah, the, it wouldn't let me go out. It was just like, no! You can't do that. I just got, uh... Points. Yeah, points from something. I don't hey, know what you, from. You broke, uh, some pots. That you I made. guess. I didn't see them, but okay. All of these climbing bullshit stuff is why I'm having you play this game. Yeah. Because I hate this. Okay, I got that one that time. Yeah, if you miss this, you die. Got it. Uh, yeah, in the P in the PS2 oh, version, um, there was a oh, there's a coin back there. Well, how the hell's that gonna work? Not the sun medal, the moon medal. That's up on top. How the hell's that gonna work? Wait, there's a moon medal on top. Yeah. That one. Um, you might have to jump back. I'll see what I can do. I think you need to get enemies to appear. Woo! Grab, thank you. Okay, now look back. That's easier said than done. Oh, I see. You have to get up there. The hell is that gonna work? Don't know. You know, it's not worth it. 
it isn't worth it. We're not 100%ing this game. I do not care. Yeah, that's how I was with a couple of these in the PS2 version. It's just like, no. But just the funny thing is, no. it seems... All the PS2 version... Version... All the PS2 coins were at least doable. Yeah. Some of them I just didn't want to go back and get. Oh, good. More enemies. Remember, guys, we've been on this for, like, 25 minutes at this point. <laughs> this is insanity. It's still How going. How long the levels take? It's yeah. bullshit. Does he have a chainsaw? Yeah, he's got... Motherfucker has a chainsaw. He's got a chainsaw baton. My god, they're just bludgeoning you. Yeah, I know. Kill the flowers. I Look, I am fucking drying. I'd like life, please. How do I go unleashed? Oh, there we go. Let's just unleash myself right now. She brings Before me I die. back to life. Bring me back to life. I need a doctor. Remember, guys, that song is about Dr. Dre. She puts that beat in my chest, pounds like a drum, shakes me like thunder. Might as well just been even more on the nose. I need Dre to be bring me back to life. Okay. Oh, look, Moon I was just making sure I had that song in my playlist. Which one? Yours? Yeah, mine. Oh, I got you. I assume. Because it's a Rascal Flat song, one of the newer ones. They were actually going to disband. Uh-huh. Um, but when That's they were about up. to disband, COVID happened. <laughs> and that inspired them to make more songs, so... <laughs> Uh, guys, there's a, a giant pandemic. Uh, I, th I think we have we some songs for this. Together, man. We got songs for this. We can make millions off of this. We can make millions <laughs> we, off of COVID. We can make bank. <laughs> let's, let, look, uh, let's not say that. I mean, <laughs> I, yeah. I mean, I got a job during COVID, so, like, I'm not, I'm not wholly complaining, but... Yeah, even I wouldn't be like, oh, thanks, COVID, for getting me my job. Like that, you just don't say that. Don't say that, man. I mean, because of COVID, all the, is it interest rates went up? Uh, something like that, yeah. Okay, now this time I think you're right. I think this time we have to, uh, do the, this. The one time. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna okay, take this to the Sonic, we need you point. to look at the camera and wave high in your in your head. <laughs> hey, look! I was uh, grinding. Sick grind. God damn it! Thank you. <laughs> I know your pain, older bro, where it just won't get up on the ledge. No, yeah, going not. back to speaking about Lego Jurassic World uh, yep. and the ledge, I was having problems with. Yep. So in order to get up that ledge, uh huh. You had to be a raptor, and you just had to jump up there. Yeah. As the raptor, and even the raptor was having trouble getting up there. Yep. And the even more bullshit thing, once you get up there, you create a raptor jumping ledge it, <laughs> from getting up there. <laughs> so it's like, how were we supposed to get up there in the first place? Yeah. For context, uh, raptors no context. in Lego Jurassic World uh, can target a specific ledge and jump up any ledge, as yeah. long as there's a raptor ledge there. Yeah. Okay, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. We're going to come back next time and continue on in this level. Yeah. Until this then, <laughs> the future is very uncertain. What is certain is you guys are awesome, and there'll be more Two Bros Game Night tomorrow. See you then! Bye-bye.